The Deerfield Beach Pier is officially back open. You may remember it was severely damaged during Tropical Storm Nicole. And lots of work had to be done. More still needed to happen. But local tenants Andrew Perez is joining us live from Deerfield Beach with how it's looking out there. Andrew, what a beautiful afternoon as well. Yeah, well, keep in mind also, you've got people that come from all over the world just to fish off of this pier, even more who watch all the live cameras that are around it online. Some might look at all this and just see a whole lot of wood and concrete, but there's actually a lot of engineering that goes into this, even more that goes into fixing and reinforcing it after a major storm. Those massive waves, thanks to Tropical Storm Nicole, really did a number on the pier in Deerfield Beach. It was mind-blowing to see the bent stainless steel uh, attachments. You could see the force of Mother Nature. Well, it's a new day off the coast as fishermen returned to the world-famous pier over the weekend. All the boards were reinforced, power and water now restored. The pier was shut down in November and the workload was a lot. We had all of our facility staff working overtime, 10 to 12 hours a day, uh, even through the holidays. They restored those connections and got the stringers back in place for the portion that we really wanted to address, which is this area west of the gazebo. Even the live cameras needed work. Some are up, but some others, like the well-known underwater cam, still need work. It's offline. Further north, Anglin's fishing pier in Lauderdale by the sea is still off limits after the storm. Deerfield city leaders excited with their progress, but say there's still a lot more work that needs to be done. At the end of the T, all of those railings are significantly damaged. There's some structural damage. We have a meeting with the city commission uh, to recommend a, um, a work authorization for our uh, consultant to come and do a full assessment of the pier. So the pier in Lauderdale by the sea, that's privately owned. The owner has said he will rebuild. City leaders here, they're going to be discussing the remaining repairs to this pier in Deerfield Beach, the International Fishing Pier, during their regular commission meeting, which takes place tomorrow evening. That's the latest here in Deerfield Beach. I'm Andrew Perez, Local 10 News.